Hello guys, welcome back to my Jack 2 Renegade Let's Play. In the last episode we just rescued Ashen from the pumping station and we destroyed some turrets which had switches be be below them. And this episode we're going to be riding this elevator up to the top where we're going to be infiltrating the, pa the palace rooftops. Let's go. Go spy on the Baron, how fun. Now this is a fast elevator, I'd love to ride an elevator like this one day. I'm not kidding. Okay, let's head straight up here, nice. Well, right off the bat, the first thing you want to do is come up here and collect this precursor orb. So we've got 26 at the moment. Remember, I'm not collecting every single precursor orb in the game. I'm only getting the ones I know of. I'm pretty sure, I think I know where most of the hidden precursor orbs are, if not all of them. I'm not aiming to collect every single one. Anyway, but look at this view. I mean, wow. You can literally see the whole sea from up here. This kind of reminds me of like an observation deck you'll see in a skyscraper. You know what observation decks are, where you get to go to the top of a building and see like the views from the s views of the city. The highest building I've ever been on myself has got to be the Shard in London. I mean that's a big building, cool, as I live in the UK. I don't live in London, but the highest building I've ever been up is definitely the Shard, which was built back in 2012. Oh. Shoot it. There we go. Oh, and of course, this is our first precursor orb. Second one, rather, near the palace rooftops. Years ago, before I was born, my auntie went up the World Trade Center's Twin Towers before they got destroyed back in the 1990s. Yeah, and I think that was pretty awesome. I wish I could have gone in the Twin went up the Twin Towers one day since I like, sky like learning about skyscrapers and stuff like that. But it's just a shame the World Trade Center got destroyed before I could visit it. I think it's a bit of a shame too, I don't hate the new World Trade Center at all, is that? I just think the Twin Towers are mu were more iconic amongst the skyline, they just suited the skyline better, they blended in with the skyline better, they just... If the skyline just looked prettier when it had the World Trade Center's Twin Towers, you know what I'm saying? And I wish they still stood to this day or they got rebuilt, like King Gardens Twin Towers 2 plan if any of you saw that. If you ever look on Google, type up Twin Towers 2 and you'll see King Gardens plan that they really proposed. Okay, we're near, the, we're near the palace now. Actually, one thing. It's a bit weird. I wonder what this is for. This must be the palace's power supply. I don't know. I'm actually a bit confused why there's so much electricity in that on that wire stuff. Okay. Here we have a very, very interesting cutscene. Enjoy. I've told you I will have more eco by week's end. We'll transport it directly to your nest, as promised. A deal is of no value if you can't deliver, my dear Baron. I grow impatient with your puny gestures. Give me the agreed-upon ego soon, or the deal is off, and your precious city will pay the price. He's toying with us! Let me leave an assault on the nest before it's too late! I can take him! Patience, Commander. No one has ever penetrated the Metalhead Nest, you know that. I've seen what comes of such foolish plans. No. Strength is their weakness. We play helpless. We train them to eat from our hands. And then... Move forward with the plan! Tell Ashland to up her patrols. I want that tomb found. But your daughter has not been agreeable. Uh, I'll see to that problem, one way or another. Ashlyn is the Baron's daughter? And find that child! If you'd spent half as much time looking for the little brat as you spent flirting with that mechanic girl, we would have pinned his royal ass to a wall long ago. As you wish. With enough persuasion, I'm sure our spy... That loaded it! What was that? Oh, how lucky are they? Yeah, very interesting. It turns out Ashlyn is the Baron's daughter. I think Jack probably regrets saving her now. Hmm, really won't do later on in the game though. Because Ashlyn is not like the Baron, I can tell you that much. Okay, let's head down here now. So, we have a rat in the walls, do we? A rat in his boy, it seems. Back for a few more Dark Eco treatments? will allow me to put you both out of your misery! Okay, here we have our first boss battle in the game. Let's get some blast ramming because I'm really low. Nice. Okay, 
Okay, target boom. Things like it's quite an easy boss battle, but don't do this. Just don't spam the button constant to blast the ammo constantly. The only the only time you take damage is when you see blue like come off the Baron when you sh every time a bullet hits him. Here I'll demonstrate here. Right, as you saw some blue come over then that shows that the, that the Baron's machine thing is taking damage. But when it when the blue icon does not appear, well when the blue does not appear, that means the Baron is not taking damage at all. And that means you're pretty much just wasting the ammo. The blast is pretty much the only weapon you can use at this point, because the blast is pretty much the only useful weapon at this point. I wouldn't recommend using the scatter gun at all for this, because the scatter gun's really not useful for this boss battle. Because the scatter gun's range is not good enough. Okay, let's begin. Let's get rid of this guy. There's wave two. I mean, this is quite a view, isn't it? But I can't stare at the view right now because we've got a Baron to take out. So if I stare down too much... If I stare down at the city too much, I'll get my ass whooped. So I can't use concentration right now. I mean, this it looks like the palace has an awesome... This could be a palace observation deck instead of just a random rooftop. Where you can enjoy views of the city. I mean, imagine if Taurus... I even see tourists could come up here and just enjoy views of the city. So I mean, many skys tall skyscrapers have observation decks. Okay, let's head to. Let's go around here now. Okay, that, do I need any health? Now I'll be right for now. Ah, I hate these whirlwinds, whirlpool things. They, they really catch me these things. She needs to be really careful. Ah! Can't die now, seriously. Come on. Yes, gotcha! The dark powers I gave you can't protect you forever! Since I made you, I can destroy you. Again soon. Yeah, whatever. Bye bye. And that is the Baron defeated for now. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can stand on here. Yeah, I can. Cool. Look, enjoy the city views. Yeah, it's a bit too foggy actually at the moment. Oh well. Yeah, I'll be back to enjoy the views one day. Anyway, now we finish defeating the Baron. Let's head out of the palace. The city's now gonna be on high alert. Guess what you're about. The Crimson Guards won't be after you, but when you act when you can activate the next mission for Torn, the city's gonna be on high alert and yeah. And Torn's not gonna be pleased about it. Guess head down. Wow. Shame I can't jump actually. While while the elevator's going down. Because I think that'd be pretty interesting. Okay, um where should we head? Okay. Let's head out. We won't be coming back in here for a while. Access granted. Fortunately not. We're back in Haven City where it's raining. Alright, I don't like rain. I like sunshine. Oh, hello. Crimson Guard. Come here. Haha. <laughs> Whoa. Holy shit, Hellcat. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Right, I'm gonna head to the hut icon. Ah. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Maybe it wasn't such a good idea. Oh. Crimson Guards have a good chance of killing me right now. Make sure you're really careful. Cool, they can't kill me now, surely. Oh, man. Really. Done. Quickly, hit this guy. No! Oh, they killed me! Okay, this is the first time the Crimson Guards have killed me in this Let's Play. Oh. I guess I pissed them off too much, so I guess I deserved it. <laughs> well, it was, a, it was a long time coming, so... The amount of times I've got the Crimson Guards on my tail, and I, was, I didn't realise how low I was on health then, so... I was going to try and survive the whole Let's Play without getting the Crimson Guards... Without dying from the Crimson Guards. Guess I can't do that now, because I've already died. Shame. I didn't realise how much health I had. Oh well. Anyway guys, I think I'm going to end this episode off here, because this, this, this mission here is actually pretty long. I think this mission will probably take a whole episode to do because that's how lengthy the le that level is. 
Okay guys, I'm going to end this episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching as always. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Sorry it's a bit short, but yeah, next episode is going to be much longer because we've got a really long mission to do. I really hope you guys enjoyed the episode, of course. If you enjoyed the episode, please be sure to hit the like button. That really helped me out. And if you want to keep up to date with all the chat to episodes I post, please be sure to hit that subscribe button because that really helped me out. And in the next episode, we're going to meet those two new characters right there and complete the mission they want us to do. And it's quite a lengthy one as well. I'll see you guys then. Here we go, guys. This is Gordy X and I'm out.